Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So before we move further, subscribe this channel. Okay, so this video is divided into two parts. The first one is how you can upgrade this PyCharm IDE to the latest one. And the second one can be how you can upgrade your lower version of Python to the latest one. And currently as 8th October, we can say that the latest version is 3.9.0. So let's get started. To check your current version of PyCharm, you can just click on this help and about. As of now, this is my current version that is 2020.2 .2. and if you are using any lower version or old version, you can simply check for updates by clicking here, check for updates. And as of now, no ID or plugin update available. And if by chance, if you are getting any update reminder, you can just update your PyCharm from that dialog box or an alternative way is just open your Google and search PyCharm and the first link, this one and uh, download. And here you can just click on this download and download will start. So just download it, run it and you will be using the latest version of PyCharm. So, first part done. Now, let's see how you can update your Python from any lower version to the latest one. So, before that, I'm just checking my Python version by uh, typing this command in my terminal that is python hyphen hyphen version and I have python 3.7.4 and the current latest version is, you can just check it from the official website that is python.org and that is 3.9.0. So just click on here and see what are the latest changes they are making in this update. So let's see how you can download this python 3.9.0. So for that, just open Microsoft Store and here just search python. Currently, I am using Python 3.7, so now I will show you how you can download Python 3.9. Just click on here, you will get these options. Just click on get and uh, wait for some couple of minutes. After clicking on the get button, the install will automatically start in your device. Now wait till it get completed. So once your download get completed, you can see your Python 3.9 here. So I opened this and you can see my current version is Python 3.9.0. And if I code something here, print uh, A. So it will print my name. So everything is perfect. So if you want to open the shell, you can just open this and my current version is Python 3.9.0. Okay, so as of now, we have upgraded our Python and PyCharm as well. So let's see what is the status of our PyCharm. So here I'm just typing the version of my PyCharm. So Python version. So here it is still showing 3.7.4. So let's see how you can add the new interpreter of 3.9 in the current 3.7. So the first step is just press Ctrl Alt plus S. So you will get this option and here just select your project and uh, Python interpreter. So currently you will see your current version of Python that is Python 3.7 or whatever you are using. So just uh, drop down and Python 3.9 you can see here and if you're not getting this option you can just add it from here add and here you can add the Python in two ways either click here and select Python 3.9 as base interpreter or click here and you will get two options that is Python 3.7 your current version or Python 3.9 that you have just downloaded. So just click on that and add a path any name and click on OK. Wait for some couple of minutes and it will load up. So once it get completed, you will see the option of Python 3.9 here. 
click ok and uh, all done so now you can see python 3.9 written here so if you check the current version of python by this command you will not get python 3.9 because this project is configured with python 3.7 already so if you want to change the configuration you can click here and just click python 3.9 or a simple way just create a new project by any name and select python 3.9 here and create and uh, this window so a new file is opened you can see python 3.9 written here and if you now check the current version of your python by clicking or oh, sorry by typing this command that is python hyphen hyphen version you will see python 3.9.0 so i think this tutorial is clear for all so we will be coding in python 3.9.0 from now onward and we will see what are the new changes of this uh, new update of python so before i end this video i want to say if you find this video little informative please share this video among your coder friend and those who are still struggling while downloading and upgrading this python and pycharm and one more thing before you leave this video make sure you like this video and subscribe my channel and also hit that bell icon to get regular update of what i am uploading because I will be uploading more on Python and game development and all those educational stuff. So that's all for today. Take care. Be happy. Goodbye.